Yeah. You get to meet him a couple of times. Be the only reason I'm meeting with him daily. is I'm going to kill him. Uh-huh. And I'm uh -huh. trying to know what Crazy. he is. He's not hey, yo. like uh, in the street hey, yo. where you could just kill uh -huh. somebody. He's in the streets a big part of me, and that's the problem with me, and that's probably why I'll never leave. Because without the streets, it'll be no me. Yeah. He's got 20, 30 guys uh -huh. around him. Hey, They're yo. not looking to fight. They're looking to kill. Yo. I'm always be in the streets, I can never leave. But what else did you expect from me, especially when I grew up in these drug infested streets? Around so much death for me, the overdoses are shooting. What else did you think I'm gonna be doing? Especially when I was influenced by the ones selling opium to users. And I always wanted to be a kingpin when I was little. And if I open you, I'ma kill you. So if you get the ups of me, you better be tough enough to pull the trigger. But I ain't scared to die. So what the fuck is a near death experience? Because when I get my chance to corner, I have to come to the corner and get you. And I don't gotta send nobody to kill you. Cause if I'm looking for a killer, all I gotta do is look in the mirror. I remember Roll running shot snowball on the dirt road in front of Sue Bowden House, the same spot Scotty living, and all he kept asking him was to stop shooting him and don't kill him. So I can a kid come from that kind of raising and upbringing and focus on education and become what I become as a lyricist. Maybe it's because writing about the pain in my life is the best way for me to deal with it. That's why I'm consistently stripping about the criminal activities I've been in a witness, nigga. Yeah, uh-huh. Crazy. These streets are a big part of me, and that's the problem with me, and that's probably why I never leave. Cause without these streets, there would be no me. Yeah. And uh, up and coming, I'm a hit guy. Crazy. He's much older. I'm told Crazy. he's got 50 hits under his belt. He's smart. He's cunning. He's dangerous. I said, I need to. I need to know who I'm fighting. I need to look at him in the eyes. I need to be with him. How the fuck am I gonna kill him? He's got 30, 40 guys. I don't even know who, what the fuck he's about. I didn't make friends with him, but I had meetings with him twice. The third meeting we had, he died. Can we please have a moment of silence? Silence. That's for my niggas doing years of confinement and for my soldiers that passed over, no longer living, that couldn't run. Whenever the Reaper came to get them, can we please pour out some liquor? Some liquor. Symbolizing this, take your time and to consider that. Though our thugs ain't here, the love is here. And we go rep till slugs kill us here. This for my dogs, stuck in the struggle, trying to gain. Smoking trauma, sniffing rhyme while selling cocaine. Trapped in a game, not knowing how to stop and get by. Deliver the life, so instead they live it to die. And can we please have a moment of peace? For every G that fell for us, flag in the streets, blood in the thugging, fucking and loking, gripping and creeping, letting the king get. Or just for poor righteous teachers. These streets are a big part of me And that's the problem with me And that's probably why I'll never leave Cause without the streets It'll be no me Yeah Uh huh And can we have another moment of silence For brothers who died from black on black violence From here to the dark continent Where rebels sell diamonds to clients All through the world got little black girls dying And can we please pour some more liquor For Will, Mo, King, Ball, Pappy, my Here's another warrior song from Nasty and Quan. It's to him I pass the baton to carry the song. Streets disciples, salute to those who gone with bullets. And I promise to rhyme and Quan, correct this life to the fullest. And can we please have a moment of truth?